This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment or educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. Listen, I've been getting a lot of messages from people telling me that their brokers have been turning on their share lending without their permission. It's absolutely crazy. This is illegal. This violates security laws, but the brokers do it anyway. And you know why? Because there are no real repercussions for their actions. Do you think they could do that to one of the one percenters who had an account with them? They could not. They would not because they know if they did that to a one percenter, the repercussions would be horrendous. But when it comes to retail investors, when it comes to pension funds, when it comes to institutions that follow the rules, everybody thinks they can do what they want with us they think that we don't have anybody that's gonna fight for us to protect our interests what I'm gonna tell you is this and I'm not telling you to buy hold or sell any stock if you do not want to lend your shares out go into your account and verify that share lending is not turned on and you know what they're going to tell you? They're going to tell you it was a mistake. It wasn't done on purpose. That somehow it just happened. This is, in my opinion, absolute nonsense. They are deliberately turning on share lending in order to make money off lending your shares without your permission. And here's the thing, and this is just my opinion. Who in their right mind would lend their property to somebody whose goal it is to destroy the value of their property? The brokers don't care because they're making money. And in my opinion, the brokers are breaching their fiduciary responsibility to the shareholders by lending out their shares, especially lending out their shares without their permission if you took your car and gave it to a parking lot and told the parking lot to secure your vehicle and the parking lot then loaned your vehicle to somebody who wanted to use your car in a demolition derby the parking lot would probably be end up in handcuffs they would probably be arrested for destruction of property but somehow these bad actors, these brokers can take your shares, lend them out to somebody whose goal it is to destroy the value of your property, destroy the value of your shares, and somehow that does not breach their fiduciary responsibility to you. It makes absolutely no sense to me. In no other industry would this business model be allowed. What we're going to do is we're going to take your property, we're going to secure your property for you, and then we're going to take your property and we're going to lend it to somebody whose goal it is to destroy the value of your property. Make that make sense. Bottom line is this. I think share lending is absolutely ridiculous. I don't see how anybody could do it. But if you choose to lend your shares, then that is your choice. But if you have not chosen to lend your shares, go into your account and verify that they are not voluntarily lending out your shares without your permission. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that in any other industry, could you give your property to somebody to take care of and they could lend it out to somebody whose goal it is to destroy the value of your property. Anyway, have a great day. God bless and I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.